Welcome to version 4 of my uh, LED cube. Compared to version uh, 3, this part of the breadboard has been replaced by a new PCB. That's the big step in uh, version 4. So let's see what we have all uh, got here. We have uh, power coming in via USB cable. It's only power. It's powering a Kyle board with an uh, NXP processor, the LPC2148. This processor is connected via three I.O. Uh, lines to uh, the driver board. Uh, from the USB we also tap power, 5 volt, and that's also powering the driver board. <coughs> On the driver board we see four SIPO chips, 1, 2, 3, 4. That is uh, serial in parallel out, so we clock uh, 32 bits in here, 4 times 8. And when they're all clocked in, they are latched and that's here uh, for octal uh, latches and then here you see a lot of transistors and they drive the, the LEDs. So here we have the uh, column uh, wires, There's, uh, uh, sorry th these are the column wires they drive the columns of uh, the LED cube uh, it's now only 5 columns but it should be 25 uh, for the next version and you see that the board is already prepared to this. We have uh, 5 times uh, five uh, drivers for columns. We only drive one column now. Uh, this is the driver for the five floors. One, two, three, four, five. So um, the next uh, step will be to uh, get rid of the whole board. Uh, we now got rid of the, the driver part. The next part is getting rid of the LEDs by uh, building it in, in a, a real uh, LED cube. That one. Bye-bye for version 4.